Hi, my name is Alicia and I'm currently a junior studying political science in the College of LAS and today for 940 feet I'm interviewing philosophy professor Dr. Noel Sines. So what do you teach and how long have you been at the U of I? Yeah, so I'm in the philosophy department and the classes I primarily teach are metaphysics, which is an upper division course, and introduction of philosophy. And I've been here for, this is my eighth year here. I got here in 2014. Okay. So within philosophy, what is your research expertise? So yeah, so I, my main research expertise is in metaphysics, which asks very general and fundamental questions about the nature of reality, broadly, broadly construed. Mm -hmm. Another uh, area of specialty is in philosophy of religion, which asks questions about how we come to know whether or not God exists, how we come to know how God is, what are the attributes of God, we have reason to believe that God exists, how should we relate to God, what's the nature of faith, and so on. Yeah. So with everything going on in the world right now, why study philosophy? So there's a lot going on in the world right now, a lot of political issues, and, and philosophy can contribute a lot to that. But I think one good reason to study philosophy is it also can get you away from all that, which can be distracting and stressful, and focus on what I want to call trans transcending questions and issues like, why are we here? What's the good life? Mm -hmm. Does God exist? Is there value in the world? How ought I to treat my neighbor and stuff? So I think it's a nice distraction from some of these issues that can, can cloud or, or stress our life out a bit. Yeah. So what do you find most fascinating about philosophy as a field of study? So I think the most fascinating thing I find about philosophy is its breadth. Mm -hmm. So just for just about any topic or subject, X, there's the philosophy of X, the mm -hmm. philosophy of history, the philosophy of fiction, the philosophy of movies, of science, of religion, of art, and almost no other discipline I think can even come close to that. There's always philosophical questions to ask about a topic. And, and, and because of that, I think philosophy is a very kind of unique discipline. Okay, so what's a project that you're working on right now that you're super excited about? So one project I'm working on right now has to do with how to understand reality in terms of fundamental bits of reality. Think here of like fundamental physics mm -hmm. and higher bits of reality. Think of here of like economics okay. or, or, or uh, biology or, or, or social facts and how it is that the lower facts at mm -hmm. the bottom give rise to the higher facts. Yeah. What is your favorite aspect of philosophy to teach to incoming students as a professor? Perhaps my favorite aspect of philosophy to teach them is to show them that there are really good and rigorous and careful arguments out there for conclusions that they might think are false or not <laughs> worth taking seriously uh -huh. and pushing them and saying, don't be so dismissive and, and seeing them struggle with it as they as they go through it. Yeah. So now I have a couple of rapid fire questions for you. Right. Ready. Shoot. Okay. So what's one piece of advice that you would give to your 18 year old self? Yes, I think it would be, uh, you don't have to be the best or among the best at what you do. It's okay to be just good and, and be content with that. You'll be a happier person because of it. Yeah. So what's the best book that you've read recently? So I don't read outside of philosophy too much at all, mm -hmm. but in the past year, I think the, the best book I've recently read is A Christmas Carol by Charles Dickens. What would you say is your favorite place to eat on campus? My favorite place to eat? I don't eat a ton of places on campus, mm -hmm. but my favorite place was probably the bread company. There on Goodwin, which I live right above there, so awesome. it's a really good spot awesome. to go to. <laughs> awesome. How would you describe U of I in just three words? So I'd say big, beautiful, and central in the sense that it, it sort of combines Champagne and Urbana into one That's sort of spans both it. of them. Yeah. Okay. yeah. How what would you say is your favorite U of I memory? <clears throat> my favorite U of I memory is having lunch here with my wife and four kids this summer, playing baseball, frisbee and everything. Yeah, great. What would you say is your favorite building on campus? Favorite building on campus is the Craner Center, in part because I've... Beautiful, I've taken my daughters there to watch the Nutcracker, and I love performances, I just enjoy that kind of stuff. Yeah. Now, this one's gonna be a little bit of a tough one, but okay. orange or blue? It's a very tough one, let's see. Hmm. Gotta go with the blue on that one. Yeah, definitely gotta go with the blue. Yeah. <laughs> okay, well, thank you, Professor Science, for joining us today, and thank you guys for watching. Thank you. If you guys wanna see any more of our interviews, they'll be on our YouTube channel. Thank you.